Welcome back to Who Chose. Today on Who Chose, we're going to do a time lapse grow. Now, we're going to use a system that I built in this video. And at the end of this time lapse grow, we're also going to give away the system and the light it's under. So it's actually my own light to give away. Uh, no one sponsored this segment. Uh, it's a Spider Farmer SF1000. Uh, these were the, some of the first LED lights I bought and I've been really impressed with the way that they've performed. So I've been getting a lot of lights and I wanna give some of those lights back to you because I mean, you're the reason LED companies are reaching out and giving me free stuff. So let's get to the grow. <laughs> To set up the system, I just took my irrigation piping, threaded it through the holes I'd made, and as you can see, in the bottom of the system, I've changed from weed matting to geofab or geotextile, which is basically just a landscaping uh, matting. I filled up the reservoir with uh, water, and then I added in my nutrients. So the nutrients I'm using for this grow are the Campbell's, Diamond Blue and Nitro Cal, which is uh, one gram per liter. Uh, I just stirred that straight in, checked my EC and my pH. Now, luckily for me, uh, my pH is actually uh, perfect with my water when I do it. As you can see here, though, uh, I need to add in some water to get the EC down uh, to, I think it was about 2.4. Now, as you'll see later in the grow, uh, 2.4 is going to be a bit much for the leafy greens I add in the system and we'll look at that as we come to it. Now this is the cheap and easy seed raising technique using the ice cube trays to raise the seedlings in a 50-50 mix of vermiculite and perlite. You can check out the video in the corner now if you want to see that technique. The bottom right and left are basil. The Top right and left are chilies, and in the middle, I'm just going to add in some lettuce, which was a mistake. Uh, obviously, the EC for chilies and the EC for lettuce is going to conflict uh, because the lettuce is a leafy green. Really, I should be running that about 1.6 to 1.8, and I'm running this at 2.4. And we'll see in a second that that's going to actually have a negative effect on how. Uh, the lettuce grows. It's going to start bolting and it's also going to show um, some burning on the top of the tips of the lettuce and I do remove it halfway through which I'll show you as well. So I'm just watering in all the seedlings now with the pump which is turned on and irrigating through the four millimeter tubing and I've set it to irrigate once every two hours. Here we go. <music>
I'm just taking these out because they're bolting because the light is too intense and the EC is too high for them. However, the other plants are doing really well. So I might throw something in there like maybe some cucumbers and then I can have them grow up through the middle. So we can just throw some cucumbers in here, I think. Yeah. There we go. So the jumping you see here is actually the plants moving up and down with the perlite, which is floating because the nutrient solution isn't escaping fast enough through the fabric. To fix this, I actually used a digital timer, which did shorter bursts once every six hours rather than once every two hours. And as you'll see in the next segment, it fixes the jumping problem. Obviously the grow's not done. We haven't got the chilies to flower and produce fruit. So let's get to the giveaway part. To be in the running for the light and the system you've just seen in action, all you have to do is either be a subscriber or subscribe to the channel, like the video, and then leave a comment underneath the video uh, of a system or topic that you want discussed in a future episode of Hoochos. So if you do all those three things, you'll go into the running to win the Spider Farmer Light as well as the full system. And I'll post it anywhere in the world. Um, I'm gonna use the Perlite as packing material um, in bags, obviously, for the rest of the stuff. And I'm happy to send it wherever it needs to go. So leave a comment, like the video, and become or already be a subscriber and you're in the running for the light and hydroponic system. In the next video, when we get to see the chilies flower and produce fruit, I'll announce the winner and I'll contact them uh, in a comment on their comment on the video and get their address and send them the stuff and yeah. <laughs> I'm really excited to give this out to one of you guys. Thank you for viewing and supporting and inspiring and all the rest. Happy hydroponicking. I'll see you next time on Who Chose. <laughs> <laughs>